Jana, fungu wa vitabu we Some ni vijana usiku na mchana Jenga maisha we Jana, fungu wa vitabu we Some ni vijana usiku na mchana Mpange ni maisha we Oh vijana, oh vijana, oh vijana we Soma, soma sana Kesho utalala Oh vijana, oh vijana, oh vijana we Soma, soma sana Kesho utalala How sometimes you can have a boss, uh, precisely like your principal, Mr. Ochipai, who does not deserve respect. Uh -huh. yeah. 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 You don't like our principal? You realize you're encouraging us to dislike him. Yeah. Yeah. The way he's concerned about your passing of exams. Yeah. He comes to school very early in the morning to supervise the students drinking their college. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Nina, keep eating your bad porridge in the morning. And you could be drinking tea and having bread. Nangasa, uh, the last issue you raised is about uh, justice. Yes. Ah, that is a big one. Uh, okay, I uh, think about, uh, yeah, some of you have managed to pay school fees, alright? Which ends up in people's pockets by selling land. Your father sells land to pay for your school fees. Now, do you know the worth of land? Uh, I know people fight over land. Eh? Land is like a hot potato, sir. Um, I remember my father nearly killed my uncle just because of a fence. Are there any offense? Yes, yes. That is how serious land issue is. Alright? So your father sells land to pay for your school fees. Next year, he sells another huge piece of land because, you know, you're going to university. By the time you finish your BA, your father would have sold everything. I mean, all his piece of land. Then you graduate. Have a certificate, and then you realize there's no job for BA holders. Oh, that's not a problem. I'm aiming to get an MA before I start looking for jobs. <laughs> Nangasa, that is if you won't get married, right, <laughs> class? <laughs> <laughs> for me, I'm not trying to get married. I mean, think I'm going to get married. <laughs> Yes, sir. Yes. You know your work, don't you? Yes, sir. All the administration work you have done is very successful. I do all accounts, sir. I pay suppliers, do monthly financial reconciliations, amongst other duties, sir. Mm -hmm. You look surprised. Or is it because of Django that the school inspector? You know he can uh, be quite troublesome, and I don't want trouble with him or with anyone else. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. To me? Yes, sir. Pull down all the minutes of the meeting we conduct. I do that all the time, sir. And does your computer have a safe password? Yes, it does, and I do back up in any case. Thank you. Ensure that no one has access to that computer. I will, sir. Salome. Yes, sir. You will know how serious your office is, yes? Yes, sir. What do you mean, yes? 
I mean, I do all accounts, sir. I pay suppliers and make sure records are well done, sir. That one I know. I pay all the workers, sir. That too, I know. What more? I bank the money, sir. And uh, what else? Sir, is there something you're not... What is the most important thing in that office? Uh, to ensure confidentiality, sir. Yes. Ensure that no one gets money from that office without proper accounting. No one receives any money from there without authorization and accounting for it. Yes, sir. I'll do that. Uh, and, uh, by the way, uh, tell Tembea to prepare the students for the presentation for the parents' day. Thank you, sir. Do your school fees, and then you get there is no job. I am not seeing any connection with justice. <laughs> it's okay, it's alright. I was thinking about what you just said. Okay, so um, yeah, so your father sells land, he pays your school fees, you graduate, have a certificate, and then you realize the rich man has built a huge factory or not used to be your piece of land. Now, do you think it would have been fair for him to buy your land just to enable you to pay school fees? Hmm? Just think about it. But Molimu, he had money, he bought land. I don't see any problem with that. Yeah. Yeah. There's a problem. Yes. What problem? There's a problem. Yes. Nina, mm -hmm. where will you live? What will you call your ancestral land? Teacher, the rich man has a right to buy land, but I think it is just unfair. Maybe education should be made free. Because you can't sell all your land just to pay school fees. Please, clap for her. <laughs> to be right does not mean you're just. Listen to this very carefully, students. You can be right to chase boys, or boys chase you around. <laughs> no, no, listen, listen, listen. You can be right to chase guns, or girls chase you around as much as you want. You might hide everything from your teachers. You might brush off your parents, but you know in your heart that you're cheating. That is why we talk about conscience. Huh? Doing right and being just are planted in your heart. Yes, Kitty? Uh, Molly, mm -hmm. uh, that point of conscience really interests me a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I did, did very well in class the other day. Oh, yeah, thank you. <laughs> Clap for me. Uh, just, okay, just explain to the girls. Uh, the meaning of Christian ethics and how that is linked to justice. Just briefly. Sorry? No, the meaning of Christian ethics and how that is linked to justice. Just briefly. Yes, just explain to the guys. Uh, natural law. Now, a dog cannot give birth to a chicken. Uh, uh, see, a male child cannot grow up to become a female adult. Now, people cannot be denied sleep. If, if students like us want to become teachers like <laughs> Mr. Tembea here, we must first of all get our master's degree. You cannot be drinking tea and at the same time you're eating porridge. <laughs> natural law. Now, natural law states that a person has the ability to choose between what is right and what is wrong. Now, naturally, we should avoid choosing to do evil. And we should avoid putting other people in trouble. Because it is against a natural law. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Please, please clap for him. That is right. <laughs> uh, the last point you raised uh, has a different interpretation. Right? So I'll explain it better in class so that you can understand it. Yeah, but that was right. That was good. That was good, Kiki. Thank you. All right. Um, okay. Uh, okay, guys. Uh, please go back to your books and uh, revise what we just talked about. Uh, let's see each other tomorrow. Okay. All right, Sana. Mushi, let's see you for a moment. <laughs>
this coming? <laughs> hey! Don't make this at all, me! You are pussy, see? Fed it to me, fed it to me. Fed it, fed it to me. Yeah, but honestly, you know, this new principal here, I should tie You know, he's not a very good man. And sometimes he cuts me off without a reason. Saucy, are you mad? Huh? Are you mad? Shame on you. Sabotage! What is going on? It's called sabotage. What sabotage? Saucy! Can you just. Shut up! Salome, huh? you know me, I don't know what's wrong with this sauce. Huh? I'm able to supply my milk and eggs since the principal came. He supplies his vegetables, sometimes maize and beans. Saucy! 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 What do you sell to this school? Tell us. Or let me put it this way. What do we buy from you? Only vegetables. And what more will you like to supply? You know, everything in my garden, I sell in my shop. What more will you like to supply? Me miss and beans as I used to. And why are you not supplying? You know, it is Mr. Shepai said that I cannot meet the supply demand. <laughs> and can't even meet the supply demand. You, you know, you are, you are the ones in this office who, who, who cut me off without a reason. Eh? You know, me, I know you are only accepting instructions from Mr. Shepai. <laughs> <laughs> cut you off. And what I'm saying is just let those friends of the principal supply their own. And Mr. said to give him my own portion. Why are you cutting me off? <laughs> oh, you guys are busy? <laughs> Mr. Chairman, with all due respect, look, this is the supply you got us. A man who cannot even know what supply means. A man who doesn't know the difference between the office and the field. A man who doesn't have respect for anybody, except for himself. Look, the supply we have. I think um, we also need to support the people from the county. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So Tommy, I think it is fair, in the interest of the law of natural justice, mm -hmm. I I recommend that you pay up. Salome? Hey, Daniel. You? Yes. Out of my office. Out of my office! Is everything fine? Yeah, everything is fine, sir. Plans completed. Plans are completed. We have five guys well positioned, mm -hmm. and we bought paraffin by the help of Saucy. Saucy? Yeah, Saucy, the kiosk guy. Okay, and... Uh... Everything is fine, sir. Uh, so, and, but make sure eh, that none of those fellows that were there knows anything about what we planned. Remember, they can betray you. They can put you, not me, you, Moshi, in trouble. Do you understand what I'm saying? You, you get it? Yes, sir. <laughs> okay, sir, I'll do the best I can. And you know you're my role model, so <laughs> I can't let you down. <laughs> okay, uh, okay, that's it. I'll just go back to class. And, uh, yeah, you just, I'll talk to you later. Okay, sir. Aye, aye. Okay, and, and be on the record. Okay, great. Aye, aye. Who is this? 
<laughs> Kabonga, you keep changing your numbers. No, I understand. Yeah. So what is it? What? My truck? Impounded? No, 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 no. My goods are not smuggled. I do very clean business. Who told you? What do you mean you can't tell me? Are we not friends? So where is my truck? Where's my driver and my turn boy? That would, would have been my first source. Hello? Hello? Hello, Kabonga, do this. Do not broadcast the news about my truck. No, 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 Kabonga, you are my friend. You can't be telling me about professionalism. You see, my business is clean, so to broadcast this would simply be telling people, including my own enemies, that I am a thief. Don't you see that? No, no, you can't do this to me. Yes, please, see what to do. All right. And see you later at the restaurant. All right. Nina, it seems we just erased everything in the discs. I'm sorry. It just asked, do you want to format and then click yes. I thought it was reorganizing the sequence of our work. But don't worry, Nina. Yeah. Things like that happen if you don't know when they are too stuff. Nina, you stupid! Mushi, how can you be angry over something very well known can happen to anyone? It can happen to you, it can happen to me, it can very well happen to anyone. And if you don't know something, just ask. Huh? Now how many times do I have to tell you this? Ask! Or are you planning to sabotage our work? Is that the reason you are with Matun? To plan on how to sabotage our work?
Chairman. Yes. Right. Yeah, I've come to see you. Okay, you know. I want to keep you because uh, there are actually some few people waiting to see you. Mm, okay. Yeah. You know, you have been a very supportive member of the BOG and uh, thank you very much for that. You are most welcome. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. Mm -hmm. I came out and, uh, to discuss uh, nothing much actually. It's about my daughter Nini. Uh, I don't know if we had a chance to discuss with her. I notice uh, she's doing very well in the club. And she has also joined the singing club. I noticed during the parents' day she sings very well. She has a beautiful voice. <laughs> She's like her mother, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. I, I, I also noticed that uh, she combines very well with the, with the girl she's into. Uh, okay. As far as I'm concerned, uh, she's a nice girl. Mm. Well behaved. Uh, but we need to look at the friends she keeps for proper nurturing. Mm. Okay. That class work? Oh, that one, I think, I can call the class master. No, 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 come on. For this, I this year, I just wanted to speak with the class master. Would, uh, would help. Okay, I do a bit of follow-up, and uh, she's not bad, but um, she's a slow learner. What do you mean, Mr. Chupai, slow learner? My daughter is not a slow learner. My daughter is not a slow learner. My daughter was doing very well in the primary. Before she came here, she was very good. My daughter is not a slow learner. Uh, uh, she is not. Uh, Mr. Chairman, what I'm saying is that, you know, uh, she's a child that is transiting to the adolescence. What do you mean? Just a second ago, listen to yourself. You said that my daughter is well behaved. I took it, it means that she's managing her adolescence well. Uh, uh, correct, correct, but uh, it's not the adolescence you are talking about. What is it? Uh, you see, you as parents might think that um, your children are not are performing poorly. Whereas, it's the other way around. Uh, you see, Nina might... In fact, Nina has maintained her standard. Because the marks and the position, you might think that uh, she's low, but uh, it's uh, the other students have improved tremendously. That should even worry me more. Even you, it should worry you more. That other students have improved their performance, but my daughter, my daughter, my daughter has maintained her standard. Uh, why don't you leave this discussion for the members of the BOG? The way we are arguing, it will take us nowhere. Then I continue paying you fees. I continue paying you fees. Uh, Mr. Chairman, why don't we meet at the hotel and continue with this chat? 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 What? You are calling this a chat? This is not a chat. This is not a chat. This is a serious matter. This is about my daughter's future. It is not a chat. This is serious for me. Chat. Chat. I'll be waiting for you at the joint. And call, Mr. Chupai. Call. Call. Telephone. Call. 530 sharp. Otherwise, I can as well forget we have that important appointment. Chat. My foot. <laughs> Jana, fungu wa vitabu we Some ni vijana usiku na mchana Jenga maisha we Jana, fungu wa vitabu we Some ni vijana usiku na mchana Mpange ni maisha we Oh vijana, oh vijana